Yo, what is up, YouTube? It's your boy 321 Jackman Productions coming at you with the reaction to Mo3, man. Broken Love official video. Mo3, rapper that I've been sleeping on, apparently, man. He's number 30 on trending right now with a song that came out two days ago, and it's sitting at 400,000 views. So, just right away, looking at views and seeing when it came out, you can tell that he's popping. He has a fan base around him, and. That's how you can tell that he has at least some talent. He has to have a, he has to have a little talent, man. This dude just can't be straight garbage and having views like this. So, Mo3, Broken Love, let's get into it. Let's not waste any more time. Well, actually, let me get on to him. I did do some research in the past. Well, not in the past, but like right before this video. And he's from Dallas, Texas. And he was shot in the head in, De in December, right? But he lived, so... Mo3, man. Maybe it was destined to happen. Maybe you're supposed to be popping. Let's see it. Thank God, though, you didn't die, though, bro. Always, always bad shit. Always bad thoughts when you think about that shit. Texas rappers, bro. I heard I heard Texas rappers are pretty good. The only Texas rapper that I know on the top of my head is C Struggs. Rest in peace to him. If you know him, you know him. Big dog. Ugh, fucking with it already. Gotta cut the lights off when it's down the slide. Oh, we felt that. Hey. Uh. Uh, I'm fucking with it already. Mo3. Really good first impressions from Mo3. That traumatized, that's not some shit you hear all the time, and it's good because that just. That's making him stand out from other rappers, and if I'm trying to listen to someone again for the second time, I'm going to pick him over someone else who sounds the same like some other people, so. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. Ugh, this man spitting some real shit, man. The lyrics on this track are really good and they're standoutable. And no complaints, really, for me. <laughs> Damn, just now he's taking that order. He's like taking that preacher approach. Dare I say this dude's giving me some Rod Wave vibes? Dare I fucking say? Oh, now he's giving me some. Dare I fucking say young boy vibes? Dare I fucking say, yo? I see Big Dog in the back, bro. Oh, that was. <laughs> My bad, yo. My bad, yo. My bad, yo. Yeah. Yeah. So this track, the vibes it's giving me is just like real vibes, like the shit that he's saying is not no bullshit and like it's all shit that I can relate to. So the fact that this track's relatable, it's gonna stand out, the fact that the lyrics are good, that goes with that, the fact that the beat's good, I'm fucking with his voice, he sounds good. I love how he switched the same, he has the same flow and like the shit with it, the same lines with it, but he just switched the words with it and it's going so hard and I'm fucking with it the second round through. Uh. 
Ugh, damn, real shit, bro. Real shit, bro. Speak your shit. Talk your shit. This track, bro. It's just... This track, you're either going to like it or you don't. If you don't listen to tracks and you let shit go from one ear to another, you're not going to like this track because that's the whole point of the track. You're not supposed to let it go out. You're supposed to keep it in. You feel me? Real shit, yo. Real shit. Hard ass chains too, Osama. I looked up I looked up Mo3 and I did find an Osama track, so that's pretty cool. Yeah, I've been sleeping on bro. If y'all liked Mo3, man, I'll definitely do more reactions for sure. I'll get in a couple more, bro, for sure. More than that. But. Oh, that hook goes hard, bro, and that's just all you need to really get someone to listen to you again. If you have a good hook, well, chances are someone's going to click on another song you make. Damn, bro, Mo3, this is the first time I've heard of him when he just got trending in the past couple of days, man, so... Let me know what you thought of that down below. If you want more Mo3 reactions, just let me know, man. I'm out.